a hexagonal pyramid of 30 mm sides with the side of base parallel to VP. So draw the development of lateral surface of the retained portion of the cut by two perpendicular planes as shown in by figure. You can see that from the figure uh, it is given like this. So we take a reference point. So with respect to the true length, so true length given it is uh, 67 mm. So we draw a line of length 67 mm here. Okay, then with the help of a compass, we are going to draw an arc here. Okay, so you can show the dimension. So that is 67 mm. You can show the dimension. and uh, we can cut an arc here okay now measure uh, the dimension of 30 mm from the hexagonal lamina 30 mm so you can cut the arcs a total six hours we can cut because it is an hexagon so mention the namings b c d e e F. Yeah. So you can mention A, B, C, D, E, F, and A. So in between we have this G and H point. Okay. So you can measure from B to G length, and we can cut the arc. Okay. So that is G, and from F to H. Okay, F to H or C to So you can cut the R there. That is E to H. Sorry, E to H it is. So now you can join all these points with a vertical line. So these are nothing but slant edges. So now we can see that all these uh, lengths were of uh, same length, the arc points which have, which have been cut 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, all are on the same length. So we should cut only with respect to okay, we need to cut it uh, only from that uh, G point. Okay. because that A, B, A, A, B, F, edge were not cutting so you should not cut it we should cut it from uh, uh, G, C, D, F So that is a mistake. Uh, so we should cut it uh, from uh, that uh, G point. So there is a vertical line there. So from that G point we should start. Okay. So all the lengths were same. So we can cut it uh, from G point here. So that is one. So next it is on the C. Two. 3, 4, and uh, we have 5, 
Okay. So we should join this. Dulp of a straight line using scale we can join. We should need to draw the basis of these uh, each triangular faces. Okay. This completes the problem.